We're moving along in chapter 11. We're at 11.3 and we're going to be adding three digit numbers. We can add three digit numbers by using a work mat that lists the place values. And the H stands for hundreds, the T stands for tens, and the zero stands for ones. So this is just like the two digit one, except now, see, now we have another place value, okay? So we're going to be adding 243 plus 162. So I've got 100, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40. That's 243. And we're going to add 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 to 162. We're going to just put these all together. So we know we have 1, 2, 300 here. Let's start with the ones, okay? How many ones do we have? There's one, two, three, four, five. So we know we have five ones. See? Three plus two is five. But look at these tens. Do you think we can regroup them? If we put these four together and we move the six up here, let's get them all nice and even. Look, it makes another hundred because we had four and six and that makes a ten. That makes another hundred. See? So we were able to regroup those tens just like we did with two digit numbers. Four plus six is ten. Now, how many tens do we see? None. We turned them into a 100, didn't we? So we put the one over here. We have zero tens now. Here's the 100 we made. We have one, two, three, four, 405. And when we step back and look at what we made, we've got 100, 200, 300, 400, and five ones, just like we did there. See? So we're going to be using this work mat to add three-digit numbers, okay? We can add three-digit numbers to two-digit numbers. Seven plus four is seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We regroup the one and put the other one down here because we can't put two digits in one column, can we? Now we need to add these. We start with the largest number, eight, and add the smaller numbers, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Can't put 12 here, that's two digits, so we have to put the 1 up here, the 2 down here, and now we've regrouped, and we need to add these, and 5 and 1 is 6. 621. All right, let's try it again. We start by adding the 1's place. We have 8 plus 0, well that's easy, that's 8, isn't it? We have 2 and a 0, that's easy, that's a 2. And now we add 4 and 2, and that's easy, that's a 6, isn't it? So we didn't have to regroup on this one, sometimes we don't have to. We have 628. Let's try another one. We have 370 plus 281. We start at the ones place, one and zero is a one. Eight and seven, we need to add these together. This is almost like seven plus seven, except it's got one more, because this is like a seven plus a one, right? We can do seven plus eight by thinking seven plus seven plus one and making a double because this 8 is the same as 7 plus 1, isn't it? So we could actually go a little quicker if we know our doubles and say 7 plus 7 is 14 and 1 more is 15. See? We regroup the 1. We put the 5 down. Now we add the hundreds place. We have 3, 4, 5, 6. We have 651. Okay? Let's try another one. We have 3 and 0. Well, that makes a 3, because we're not adding anything to the 3. We're adding none to it, right? We have a 6 plus 4. Well, that's a 10. So we regroup 
Put the one up there, the zero down there. Now we add the hundreds, five, six, seven. We have 703. When we add a place value column and get a two digit number, we need to regroup a digit to the next place value because we can't put 10 into this column. There's only room for one number, one digit. So we have to put it over into the next one, don't we? Okay? All right, let's try some problem solving. Bob sold 359 tickets for the school fair. Dave sold 281 tickets. How many tickets did they sell in all? So we have to think. We have to circle the important numbers. So let's do that first. We've got a 359. We've got a 281. We have to look for clue words to find the correct operation to use. Do you know if this is going to be addition or subtraction? Well, the clue word I see is in all. That tells me that we need to add, right? So remember, keep the digits in the correct column and regroup if we need to. So the numbers we have are 359 and 281, and we're adding. 359 and 281. We start in the ones place. 9 plus 1 is 10. We regroup. Put the 0 down here. Now we have our 1 in the tens place. We add the tens, starting with the larger number, 8. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. We can't put the 14 here. We have to put the 1 up here and the 4 down here, don't we? Now we can add the hundreds place. 4, 5, 6. And we make sure we label it because word problems need to be labeled for the answer, okay? So we have 640 tickets, okay? Got to label it. All right, so in our next video, we're going to continue adding three-digit numbers. We're going to get a little bit more practice because after that, we're going to be subtracting with regrouping, okay? I hope I'll see you there. Bye.